Hey, how we doing? We're going. Today, I'm prepared to make up some uh, peanut butter and honey sandwiches for you. Fried. So, uh, first, what we got to do, got to gather up our ingredients. First, get our bread right there. Go over here to the pantry. Grab some uh, peanut butter and honey, I think. That's what we're going to need. There we already got the GF, especially GF. You want the GF, you don't want any of that other crap. Got your honey, clover honey. You want that stuff too, that's good stuff. Uh, we got some butter, we gotta get some butter now. Get some butter. Oh, there we are. Right here, get this butter. Home style spread. Gotta have it. Next. Gonna do. It's the tricky part. Gotta grab two pieces of bread. Don't wanna grab more than two. Take off your tongue. Don't want that to happen. Get it. Untie this sweet little tie here. Get your bread out. Got your two pieces of bread. So first, first off right here. You don't want that to burn, so you gotta set it aside of everything. Find your knives here. Got this drawer right here. Get yourself a butter knife. How else are you gonna spread the butter? Alright. All right. First, you're gonna lightly spread some butter on one side of the bread. Alright. Do one of these. Back and forth motion if you want, whichever one's. Doesn't matter. As long as you get the butter on there. Back. I like the back and forth though, so whichever. What you're gonna do first, how I like to do it, you just slap it right on there. And you turn it probably to about, uh, we'll just go, we'll put it on high for right now, get her cooking fast. Nope. We'll switch her to in between the medium and high. Then you bust out the jiff. You gotta unscrew the lid so you can get the peanut butter out. Alright. Kinda do one of these, dump the butter in there. Get a little bit of butter on the knife, kind of. Don't, don't burn your finger, that'd be a bad deal. You don't want that to happen. Yeah, spread it around on there. Don't break the bread like I just did. That's a bad deal, too. All right. So you're spreading it. You can either do the back and forth motion like you did with the butter. Hmm. I wouldn't do it, though. That's a bad choice. You want these? Don't want to leave too much spaces on there. Get some more peanut butter. You wanna, you wanna fill her up. You wanna fill this piece of bread up. Yes, I do have some good spreading technique. I won't lie to you. Then you grab the honey right here. This bear-looking guy kind of scares me. Well, uh, kind of squirt a little bit on here, you know. Kind of sit her like that. What you gonna do? Grab some more butter. Peanut butter, actually. I was joking with you guys. See if you guys pay attention. Grab your other piece. Just spread it on there. Gotta hurry up because it sounds like my uh, bread's cooking fast on the other side. That's a bad deal. Yeah. We better hurry up. Do one of these. Put a little peanut butter on there. Kind of lather it, you know. You want it to be lathered. Make your food taste good. Kind of slap her on there. One of these. What you're gonna do, wipe her off. Get yourself some more butter. Just slap her on the top there. Very nice. I'm not doing the back and forth technique anymore. It's kinda out of style. You gotta do just a slide on. Just a slide on. Do one of that. Wipe your uh, knife off there. Hmm, got a little peanut butter on my finger. Come over to your little cleaning station. Wipe off the fingers, do the flick, flick, flick. Then what you're gonna do, you're looking for a spatula. So you go over here, grab your spatula. Kinda tip her up a little bit, see how one side's doing. Yeah, I don't think so. So now we're gonna wait for a little bit. While you're waiting, we gotta find the plates real quick. We're going right here. Come and grab your plates. This side's open, right here. We're going to go up here and grab yourself a plate. Yeah, we'll just take the whole stack out. 
and stick them together. Grab two stick because you don't want them to break. You want to bring them over here. Might as well just close up your bread. Don't want the bread to get stale. Or stale or however you say that. I'm not an English teacher. Yep, that'll have to do for right now. Got kind of sling it around in a circular motion. And what you're going to do, you're going to tie her on top. Yeah, we better check that it's kind of smoking there. We're going to flip her over. Whoop. Whoopee. There we are. He's all right. Little black won't hurt anything. Probably will, but it'll taste all right. Grab your plate. Just kind of wait for a little bit. You might as well just put up the rest of your stuff, you know. Kind of, where's your knife over here? We'll just use this spoon. It's closest. Kind of sling that off of there. Gonna put the cap on. And now I know what you're wondering. You're wondering where I got this fly gear on. I made a trip to Hawaii here the other day, here the other weekend. I have a family up there, you know. Yeah, pretty nice. Got it for free. Well, I think we're time to check this bad beast out. Check, oh, I think we fell apart there. It's not good. Yeah, that's good. I think he's crippled. I think he'll be fine. I think that's what a finished project product looks like. So we'll slap him on there. I don't know what's wrong with him. He looks a little weird. So what we're going to do, we're going to take him off the heat. We're going to turn your guy off here. Turn the stove off. Kind of wipe the knife off here. Where's your lid at? There we are. we got to grab the lid. Put this back on there. Come over here and put it back in the fridge. Yep. Put him in. Slide him in right, in right in there. Looks like a good place for him. Get this. Yeah, put all your equipment over. Over here in the sink. That's what we're going to do. I don't know what this is, but I'll put it in there anyway. Here we go. We'll let me put this down here. Kind of. You like the sizzle? It's very nice. It's a soothing sound. Put you to sleep. Let him cool down a little bit. He looks a little hot. Been out in the heat too much or something. Yeah, but I think he's done. Well. Well, I guess what you, else you could do? Come over here and grab another knife. Might want to grab a sharper knife. This will have to do for right now. Kind of little guy, I guess. What you could do is slice him in half. Whichever way you want. It really doesn't matter. You're going to eat her anyway. Do one of these. You can even cut it into party sizes, finger foods. Kind of wipe him off. Well, that's about how the about how it should look like. 